Welcome back, everybody, to The End Is Nigh, with our friendly little ghost over there. We are going to go up, up, and away to the um, Wall of Sorrow. Yes, after much deliberation, decided to go up. I don't see anything wrong with that. Now, of course, I've gone ahead, played through it once. Maybe I'll be slightly less incompetent this time around. And if I could describe this place in three words, it would be menacing and bird manipulation. And you'll see what I mean by the latter soon enough. Don't you worry. Don't you worry. Any little bit. It starts off quite standard-like. Just do some relatively interesting jumps. <laughs> and uh, grab some tumors on the way there. Standard fare, and of course relatively tricky considering we're pretty far along in the game at this point. There we go. And go ahead and save that little boy right there. So yeah, trying to keep yourself in place while you're on moving platforms. A little bit tricky. But it's manageable. Those are just the first two levels. Now we time to put your uh, Really put your money where your mouth is. Test your metal. Oop, it extruded me off the edge. Pardon me. Just hanging out in my little nook. Waiting for a time to escape. By the way, uh, on the right side of the screen, there's nothing there. I've tried getting there. I mean, theoretically there could be something there, but I could not find a way to get there. It's just barely out of reach. And it's got me all bothered because there should be something there. But, here we are. Maybe there is something there. Maybe I was just too incompetent to reach there. God only knows. <laughs> That's... Tumor take two. Okay. That's the tumor. And now we just have to escape with our lives. Close jump there, but doable. Doable nonetheless. Watch this. Oh. Oh, hold on. Hold on a minute. Are you suggesting... No. I got closer the first time. I've already proven to myself that this is not doable. And yet here I am, still trying to go down there. Yep, there's no corners, there's nothing to aid ya. That's all there is to it. Oh look, clouds. Don't mind if I do. An introduction to the concept of lowering clouds to uh, suit your desires. And then being able to hop rhythmically to allow the cloud to rise. Goodbye, little floaty tumors. Oh, they're just a nascent little boy. They're just a little benign, little benign assortment. Stop long jumping, there we go. By the way, there's nothing in that little nook either. Despite how tantalizing it is. You can land in front of those spikes, but there is no advantage in doing so. It's been done once before. Hey, what is this jump? Excuse me? It's a little deceptive, isn't it? There we go. Should not be so much of a problem. Okie dokie. Ghosts. And uh, don't jump directly into the spikes, thank you. These ghosts will kill you if it's not obvious enough. Ah, the cloud rises into the spikes. Word of caution. Oh my. That was an interesting uh, collision detection right there. Definitely stop the cloud's ascent before you grab that tumor. There we go. Oh, he's a crafty little ghost, isn't he? Get the heck out of there. Excellent. Excellent performance. Um, I mean, you can speedrun this guy, probably. Yeah, no problem. Don't mind me. D <laughs> oh, 
Oh, he's gone and retrieved it. I don't think there's any secrets up there. Yeah, that'll do it. Oh, bird. Bird. Mini Krampus. Let's go. You and me, bird. Let's enter this key crevice, shall we? We don't even need to do anything with the bird to go in this key crevice. This is our first key crevice, too. Let's have a see. Let's have a look. I've never explored one of these before. Because on my other file, I did not get any spare keys, you see? And now we just have to get through the ghosty minefield of fun extravagance and uh, perilous spooks and poltergeists. I didn't even realize there were three switches to go through here. That's a bit of a pickle. Now we're talking. Just one more to go. There we go. What splendorous joys await us here. Another key and a large tumor. Okay, okay. Alright. Oh, uh, oh, 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 this is a little bit of a panic at the cloud disco. Okay. Well, preserving this key is going to be a little bit more difficult. And you can't just escape through the bottom. That is certainly a tricky one. Yeah, these, uh, these key areas, they're no joke. There we go, save the key. And grab this here mega tumor. In some fashion. This is gonna be an athletic adventure. Ooh, he got close. Oh, there's a spike down there too, huh? Alright, that works. Un oh, okay, well, I mean, say whatever you want to say, that is apparently possible. <laughs> Video games. Video games. Video games, games, games. Some more bird dodging. Nothing out of the ordinary. Except watch out, because they can ravage you from off-screen. So be careful when you're approaching that exit in the very tight crevice. They can also ravage you on-screen, so keep a mindful eye out. Okay. Now we just gotta, uh... Ride the cloud wave. Beautiful. Now here's a real mystery. Can he rise without getting pestered by birds? I could have gone in the bottom portion. Okay, yeah, the bird hitboxes can be a little finicky. Touching even the slightest side portion of the bird will result in your immediate demise. There we go. Notice how you can jump on birds, as you could with frogs. This will come... This will become of importance. Soon enough. Soon being right now. Timing. Also, you're gonna have to use your long jump to get the horizontal velocity necessary to match speed with this bird. Come here. Bird manipulation. Bird manipulation. That is our phrase of the day. Hello. Um, can't help but notice that you did not guide me into the vicinity of that tumor. I'd appreciate if you could. How did your boy do this last time? Excellent question. Talk to me later after we go through this secret area that I will get to soon enough. <laughs> Just have to do a tiny little spike jump, no problems here. Just tiny little spike jump, no problems here. One frame jump. One frame man able to defeat his enemies within the time span of one frame one sixtieth of a second 0 0.017 hello friend oh hey I didn't know it was you you realize we're being punished right we did something wrong at some point something we can't undo and this is our eternity 
He's gonna betray you, you know. He always does. Fine by me, buddy. Ooh, ooh, ooh. One of the more easy cartridges in the game. And, uh, you just have to return now. Oh, that's right, there's clouds. Anyways. I don't believe that there were any mega tumors yet. So if you do fall off those ledges while you're getting the cart, you have to go all the way back through this nonsense. Every time. And impatience. Alright, let's go. Now here's the right mystery. So we did this. There's no mega tumors in here, no, it has a big ol' X on it. That's fine. Let me just kill myself. Yeah, no, no secrets here. Now here is the fun escape. There we go. Now, notice that you need to do some more bird tactics. You specialize in uh, bird law. Because if you do, that'll help you out here. Verily, as you try to ride this bird to your destination. Notice how I still have an attempt to get this tumor. I'm completely blanking on how to get it. So I'm just going to distract myself with these side duties. Get out of here, ghosts. Nobody wants you. There we go. That's pretty uh, low tier bird manipulation. And this one, bit trickier. Bit trickier. Oh, 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 there's a hole in the floor. But you gotta keep your eye out. Oh. They're kind of in a nefarious formation. It's not very conducive to your success. And that's kind of the whole point of game design. To provide some sort of challenge to the player. Can't really debate that. Unless it's an easy game. This is no easy game, though. This is Birdemic on your screen in video. Coming soon to a Steam s Steam store near you. Notice how these birds are only gatekeepers, there's no tumor there. The real tumor is up here. Not even here yet, but after this bird, that's when you can finally get your clutches on something tangible. There we go. There it is. Hello, friendly friends. How do you do? So we'll take this tumor. Now the real mystery is... <laughs> Getting to that ghost is possible. I'll tell you this straightforward. Uh, it's been done by one man on the planet. Now, on the other hand, there's no tangible reward for doing so. You just get to talk to this boy. <laughs> Tried to suck me out. Sorry, buddy. I died first. There is... effectively nothing to be gained by talking to that ghost. I mean, you can just see, like, what... What is the intent here? The bird turned around in mid-flight, and honestly... You're sucked up, and that's all you can do about that. Also, this... this tumor... Well... A couple problems. Hey, bird. I'm down here. R.E. R.E. Forward. You'll get a kick out of this. 
Get a load of this secret block, huh? Yeah, no need to bird manipulate here. I mean, it would be nice to actually get the tumor this time around. But yeah, simple stuff. A lot less Angry Birds nonsense than you might have uh, expected. He's already bumped it up. Well, that is A-O -oh good. We'll just go around from this side, shall we? Nope, can't do it. It's always interesting to see the game where the game decides to uh, enforce some fairness. Anyways, there's that. Let's keep it going, shall we? Upwards to ten. Ten. Tain. Whoa! Hey, hey! Buddy, you can't just thrust me upwards off of your own skull at your will. No, sir, that is something I do at my own accord. How extremely rude. Alright, now we have some classic platforming puzzles. This is the kind of good gravy to tell you about. This is the kind of stuff back in my day. This is the kind of thing that defined a platforming. Yes, that's right. Now we just shimmy our way around, and we'll be good to go. Hello. Was there a secret down there? Maybe. Maybe not. There's one more mega tumor, and I believe it's... I think I remember where it is, so there's no problems here. Yes, you can bird manipulate to get this tumor. Do you need to? Absolutely not. Just go around, grab that. Now here's the issue. <laughs> you have to face a little bit of a death cycle, but it's no problem means very little. And now you just dodge the burbs. Which is honestly fine because they never end up directly in your position as long as you stand still. Now this one's a bit tricky. You go up here, you go up there, you grab this bad boy. And you don't suffocate and you live through this jump, that can be a bit of a trick. But... And he's done it. Very nice, very good performance. Now, we rise these blocks. Keep it coming, keep... Keep the uh, successes rolling, let's go. You can escape here. Just be careful of the death funnel that you might find yourself placed in. Like uh, this, for instance. This is not supposed to happen. There we go. He caught a good grip. It is not unsalvageable, although it can be very intimidating if you're unexpected. Uh, if you're not expecting a little bit of a death nado there, I know I was pretty spooked my first time experiencing that uh, return trip. Whew, anyways. Onwards. 162 tumors, my oh my. Notice that ledge there. It is reachable. Just gotta lower this cloud here. And what bountiful secrets lie below? Well, it's him. It's Mr. Mega Boy. A relatively straightforward one compared to some of those gnarly, gnarly individuals in the past. Oh, oh he actually suffocated. Absolute madman. It'd be wise to jump. There we go. That is how the big boys and girls do it. Bump, bump. I feel your heart beat to the beat of the drums. Oh, what a shame that you came here with somebody. Once told me the world is. You like that? You like that? Uh, mashup. It's of my own creation. Glad you're enjoying it. Anyways, that tumor has been acquired. That sneaky little boy into my pocket. And there's another one to look at here. We don't speak of that incident. Hello. Goodbye. Ooh! A little bit tricky. Be gone, Tumor. You have been collected. 
That counts. That counts. And now we just have to survive. No problems, right? No problems at all. There we go. And, at long last, we have achieved... We have reached the precipice. Look at this grandiose rising platform. It's gorgeous. And immediately we are thrust into the neighboring zone. Yes. Which will await us next time. Another of our final three areas. We've arrived at the SS Exodus. Classic airship style level. I will see you next time as we explore this fun little airship. Thank you very much for watching, and if you enjoyed the episode, be sure to leave a like down there, if you're feeling up to it. Again, thank you very much. I'll see you next time, where we leave off here.